Hey guys, it's Red Panda Gamer. Everyone, it's Red Panda Gamer. Here for another exciting episode of Let's Play Animal Crossing City for Very Gear. And we're here to play this game that I've been playing for so darn long. I cannot believe it. It's 8.30 p.m. on August 3rd, 2012. And I want to start this off by saying, if you have a problem with my commentary in these videos, I apologize for that. But just so you know, this isn't really a Let's Play formatted thing. This is basically just a thing where I join you guys for every single day of my life for an entire year and talk to you. That might necessarily be about the game. It might more necessarily be about myself and my life and what's going on. It's more of a daily vlog to video games than it is a Let's Play. Because when you play a life sim game for about a year of your life, Especially when that life sim game is only as complex as, you know, a five-year-old's life. I mean, obviously that's not entirely true, but Eunice, why did she, what did she send me? I'm all better now, thanks to the medicine you gave me. Ah, oh, that was nice of her. Oh, what a, what a sweetie. What a sweetie. But yeah, no, I mean, I got a comment yesterday, and actually, or maybe it wasn't yesterday, but the other day, and it actually made me laugh because they were comparing me to PewDiePie and Toby Games. Toby Games and PewDiePie? Oh, yes! How does she know I like table tennis? Ah, oh, table tennis is like one of my favorite things watching the Olympics. Oh, Eunice is the best. Oh, fucking awesome. Um, <laughs> but, um, yeah, they compare it, and they're like, well, they're tired, and they never complain about it, and all you do is complain about how tired you are, and, you know, blah, blah, blah. Basically just complaining about what I talk about in these videos and I don't appreciate that not just because I you know I know I do complain about it I know I say I'm tired and I know I talk about my day but that's what this series is and it's not every episode and I'm sorry I don't do webcam videos where I just freak out at every little thing all the time or just do what's popular or just have the same recycled commentary over and over and over and over and over again for everything I do sorry that's not me Sorry, I actually try to do different stuff on my channel, but whatever. Some people just have, you know, bad taste, and but I mean, I guess not some people. A lot of people do, since both of them have like a million subscribers, which is, I mean, good for them, I guess. But you know, most generic things are popular. Look at reality television. Just saying. Um, but I'm happy with my channel, and I'm happy with my content, and I'm sure that once this is over, this series, I'll go back to more. I'll have much more actual stuff going up. Hopefully, that's the idea. And actually, today I was playing with the idea of a 365 Days of Minecraft series. And I was kind of mapping out how, what I would do. It would be a lot easier than this, because I would actually, it'd be more about gameplay than just talking about my day. Um, and talking about how I'm tired. But, um, I, uh, the only problem is, I don't want to just become a Minecraft channel. And then, I, and I was really thinking about, like, 365 Days of Minecraft isn't that big a deal. I mean, there's people who do Minecraft every single day, you know, on their channel. And I don't want to become a Minecraft channel. I mean, I, and that's what would happen, because I would do mods on one day, texture packs on another day, um, adventure craft on another day, custom maps on a day, and then just straight survival. And it would get really repetitive. Or not, it, that's No, it wouldn't get repetitive. I mean, that would be the nice thing of it. You know, it would be very... There would always be something new I could try, always something new I could do. And it'd be relatively fun to record, and I wouldn't necessarily have to record it every day. I'd just have to upload every day, which is one of the things I don't necessarily like about this show, this um, stuff, because it's kind of agonizing to just literally have to take 15 minutes out of your day every day to record. And I know that sounds ridiculous. <laughs> Holy shit, what is that thing? That thing is beastly. Don't wiggle. Get away. Oh, I got it. What is it? What is it? <gasps> Atlas Beetle. At last, Beetle. What do you want? So, uh, Cupcake. Yeah, uh, I've talked to... You're already gonna move out? I see. Yeah, I still haven't decided which day is. I wanted to tell you as soon as I saw you. Huh. He was only, I guess I didn't really talk to him ever, though, but I, was, I mean, he just moved in, so that's kind of weird. Um, just got the Atlas Beetle. 
But yeah, so I was playing with the idea, and I just, I don't want to become a Minecraft channel, and I don't want to just give Minecraft, I know a lot of people would like that, but I also know a lot of people wouldn't like it, and it would just be like how this series is, where I do double uploads and stuff like that, which would be fine, but I don't know, I don't think, I don't think I'd like what would happen with my channel, because I'm sure it, it'd help me get popular, I'm sure I'd get lots of views for it, and I'm sure it would, you know, be interesting, but I don't know. I'm more of a Nintendo channel, or that's what I want to be. I mean, obviously, I don't want to just limit myself to Nintendo. Actually, what I really would like to be, <laughs> what I honestly would like to be on my channel is an indie-based channel, because I play so many indie games, and the nice thing about indie games, I'd like to, okay, I'd like to be an indie and retro channel, you know? But the problem is, there's just not much there for indie or retro. That's the thing that sucks about Let's Playing these days, or just game, you know, video game content in general, is you have to stay relevant. And it's pretty difficult to stay relevant if all you're doing is retro or just games that are indie, which also, not always, often though, out of all the indie games out there, translates to, you know, no one caring about what it is. Unless you have a high indie base, like fan base, of people who depend on you to see what's popular in indie. And that's what, um, what well, channel I really like and would love to be similar to is uh, Indie Static. And he's grown a lot really fast, and I think that's because he's become really close with developers, plus all the stuff he does with the game station. You know, his channel's grown really fast, and I'm a really big fan of his content, and I'd love to be able to do, like, what he does. But at the same time, now that he's around, it makes me feel like I shouldn't do what he does, because, like, it's one of those, you know, there's only enough room in this town for the two of us. But then, you know, the beauty of YouTube is I can do whatever I want. I don't... <gasps> Dude, the Alice Beale looks... I think I already gave him one, didn't I? I feel like I might have. Ooh, I did. I said it is. Isn't it? Let's Stop, I leave. It's a problem. Crowded with three horns, the Alice Beetle is known as the strongest of the dynastic beetle. Blech, I wonder if it had three horns when it was in its larval form. I simply love the larva. All squishy and squirmy. Nightmarish, really. Blech. <laughs> I love lathers. Yep. Ah, oh, shit. Because I... Yeah, no, you already know. But, you know, I could always have, like, a retro show. I could have an indie show. I could have a mod... A, you know, a new game. Like, I could do whatever I want. I don't know. That's the route I feel like I'm gonna go with my YouTube channel. Dinosaur Trap. That's pretty cool. I might hold on to that. It's kinda cool. I don't really have any fossil stuff because I don't really like the bones and I don't really want, like, a complete, um, dinosaur because it just takes up tons of space. Unless I put it in my basement, maybe. Um, what was I was gonna say? Oh! I think that's the route my YouTube channel is going to eventually take, or at least I'd like it to, is I think what's going to happen is I'm going to try and focus on finishing all my Let's Plays, which I have a lot. At least the main ones I'm going to try and finish. And with some of the Let's Plays, they're not really finishable, per se. Like, Spelunky, yes, I can show the end of the game, but there's, you know, still a lot you can technically do with it. Minecraft Xbox 360 Edition, that's going to be the next one to end. Um... And then, uh, what else? Earthbound is- Ah, oh, goddamn! Earthbound, I actually recorded another episode of it today, so that'll be going up soon. And then, um, I mean, I know there's a lot. You know, that's the thing. Fallout 3 needs to be finished. But, you know, what's probably gonna happen with Fallout 3 is I'm gonna do all the- Oh, hey, Eunice. Hi there, Cupcake. I can't get over how quickly today went. Uh, oh, you're not gonna talk to me about all that stuff. Okay, fine, whatever. I know, and there's no sunshine. It's freaking nighttime. I think you might still be sick. Um, but I think with Fallout 3, what's gonna happen? I mean, I originally wanted to do a full, complete, 100% playthrough of it, but I just don't think that's in the cards for me right now. So what I'll probably end up doing is just um, finishing all the DLC because I would like to show all the DLC. A couple more of my favorite missions, and then just beating the game. And then eventually doing bonus episodes of missions, stuff like that. But, I don't know, only the future will tell. And then eventually I'll get into stuff like more scheduled days, where it's like Minecraft Monday, Retro Thursday, Indie, whatever. 
and then in between that will just be whatever else. I, I don't know. Only the future can really tell. I just would like to have more structure to my channel. And I feel like that would help out a lot instead of just, oh, I wonder what Red Panda Gamer is going to upload today. Oh, cool, Fallout 3. Oh, cool, Earthbound. Oh, cool, Minecraft, Xbox Like You know, and it's just, that's not what I want. The only reason I do that is because that's just how I am. Like, that's just how I play video games. You know, I just play them at random. I'm like, oh, I feel like playing Earthbound today, so I play Earthbound for three hours. Oh, I feel like playing Fallout 3. I don't really feel like playing Fallout 3 for a while because I died and... And I had a bad recording session. You know, it's just, it, it's it's a hard thing to understand if you don't, if you're not the same way, so. Ideally, my channel will just start having more structure, but with me moving out, officially moving out, I signed my lease on Sunday, I feel like that's going to give me a lot more time for my Let's Playing, and, you know, when you live alone, you don't have to deal with, you know, oh, my family's home, or oh, it's super late at night, I need to be quiet. It's just, you're living, and when you want to record, you record. And that, I feel like, is one of the biggest reasons that one of my other favorite channels, We Write to Pray, who I'm actually kind of friends with, I think their videos are great because they all live together in a house, and they can just record whenever they want to, which, I mean, is a big reason I think their videos are so good, and why they just put out so much content. But anyways, guys, enough um, talking about YouTube. I'm going to end this episode now. Please like this video, favorite this video, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Do whatever you got to share love. I'm Repanda Gamer. Thanks for watching. Bye.